Look at the front where it says Ames real big. Well, greetings from Boardman, Ohio, everybody. Hola from Boardman. We are at the brand new, wonderful, clean, good looking Meyer. They have finally opened their brand new store here. They opened on May 13th. It is now just a couple of days later. And we are here to do our little walking tour around this place. We couldn't make it here on grand opening day because I work during the week and after work I was just so tired because I have a lot of projects I've been doing outside of work besides filming videos for you guys. So, um, and if you can't tell, I'm pretty tired now because not only did we have Waldemere Park yesterday, but we also just left the Penguins playoff game today, which we lost, but that happens. But we figured after the game we'd come out here and check out Meyer. And we're going to go ahead and do that and show you around this really awesome brand new store. I haven't even been in there yet, so I don't even know how it looks in here. But if it's anything like the other Myers we've been to, we're in for a treat. So let's go in there and take a look around this brand new store. See how it looks. Yay! <laughs> Yay, Meyer. Meyer. <laughs> Meijer. 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 <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, let's do this, guys. See how awesome this new store looks. Ooh, don't shut on me. <laughs> That's their, I guess, their general manager. Wow. Wow, very nice. I love that new store smell too. <laughs> Look at how large this place is too. Maybe not as big as some of the other locations we've been to, but it's still very nice. Uh-huh. All right, let's take a walk through here. place is insanely busy. Wow. Yep, and you got all your refrigerated goods. This is all the food area on this side. Look at some of the treats they have here, too. They usually have some good snacks here. They usually have a bunch. Look at these cookies. These cookies look good. These ones down here, these ones up here. Like the star shaped ones. But yes. This is the brand new Meyer. Here's their wines and spirits section over here. And the one thing I like about Meyer is they actually carry Shiner from Texas. So it's graduation time, so they actually have graduation goodies up here that you can get. Oh, and summer ones too, like the little tablecloths. We got more over here too. And more here as well. Cool stuff. Let's take a walk down this way. So yeah, they've only been open just a few days and it is so well stocked in here. Naturally, everybody's flocking to come to the store. Why wouldn't they? But yeah, very well stocked store. 
a little bit of everything. I wonder if they have Pib. Let's find out. No, oh, I don't see it. Oh, wait. Yes, I do. I found it. Right. Right there. <laughs> Good old Pib. It's hard to find around these parts anywhere. <laughs> Meyer, though, you don't disappoint. Thank you. One thing I was happy to see, Skyline Chili. You guys know I love Skyline. Happy to see that here in stock. Good stuff. All right, let's take a walk down here. This place is extremely busy. It's unbelievable how difficult it is to do this. <laughs> Matter of fact, it looks like we're gonna have to go this way. It's impossible to walk down some of these aisles, but I, I mean, hey, they're making money. That's good, but it's impossible to walk down some of these aisles. <laughs> but this is a walk down the back racetrack of the store. And now we're working our way into entertainment and electronics and pet supplies. There's another shot down that way. That goes to the front to the other side of the store. And just like that, this aisle empties out. But this is the other half of the grocery section, the back half. And all these aisles are very long, very nice and clean. Well stocked. And we'll just go down one aisle here. And you'll see just how large a section is. There's paper towels. And then down here is the bread. Yep, and then we're back here to where the refrigerated and frozen foods are. And I mean, just look at this aisle that they have. All the cheese on the left, butter, margarine, orange juice on the right. The place is cray cray. Wow, look at this wall with all the sweets and treats. Cookies, they got little tiny cupcakes on the other side. Cornbread, oh yeah, sign me up. What are these cornbread toaster tops? I never even heard of those. <laughs> they look good. Might have to pick up a, a case. But yeah, and then they got some bread back here too. And over in here is all the cookware. And it's like a miniature Walmart. It really is. They have that much stuff in here. It's actually quite comical how difficult it is to film in here because literally everywhere I go, someone gets directly into the shot or stops right as I start to pan or move around or they walk right out in front of you. <laughs> that was to be expected though. It's, it, 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 it is what it is. <laughs> I'm just happy to be here to check this place out, not just for myself, but for you guys and to do some shopping while Kayla's wandering off buying things with my debit card. Here I am doing the video for you. <laughs> All right, let's get away from the madness, which is the grocery section, and walk back here. In front of us is where they have men's clothing. They even have women's clothing, children's clothing. So, yeah, and like I was showing you where, where all the kitchen wear is and all the kitchen goods. They have plenty. They have plenty of goodies here. Anyway, let's go back this way. Lots of lunch boxes. 
we'll walk down this aisle now. Excuse me? Sorry. See what I mean, guys? Literally everywhere I walk, I'm almost getting run over. <laughs> it doesn't matter where it's at. And then here's, uh, here's children's clothing, since I'm getting run off again. <laughs> and then we're walking up on toys unexpectedly like that. Oh, look at that. We're in the aisle with the Hot Wheels cars. What is the odd of that? I don't see any Hot Wheels, though. Oh, look at this. They have Back to the Future. That's sweet. That's cool. I don't see many Hot Wheels, though. They've probably already been picked over. <laughs> yeah. That quickly. I believe it, though. By the way, yeah, we're back on this side here where they have seasonal and electronics and pets. They got bedding, too. But here is their electronics department. Pets. They have a big pet selection, too. They even have hardware on my left. I hear birds. <laughs> I heard b birds. Oh, I see fish. Let's go back to where the fish are. They're back here. Even Walmart doesn't have fish. We're swimming on over, so they didn't even get them in yet. They will be. They will be getting them soon. <laughs> That's cute. All right, so here's the back of their pets department here. Like I said, it's very large. And while we're at it, they actually have a garden center at this one. I don't remember seeing a garden center at any other location. But keep in mind, I haven't been to many Myers. So let's go out here and take a look around. Wow, yeah, they got lots of stuff out here. Now, you're only seeing a little, tid like a little uh, tidbit of it back here. But if we walk up towards the front, you'll see all the awesome plants that they have. Really nice. Really nice store. Very busy. Very, 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 very busy. <laughs> I literally can't even tell you how much I've nearly been run over or walked into already on this trip, but that's how it is. Yeah, look at the, the flowers. Quite a lot of selection. I like these ones right here. These ones right here are good looking. Lilies. Hmm. Yep, very big garden center. Very nicely done, too. They even have a greenhouse here with more. Hmm. Yep, here's their electronics. Yep, this is their electronics department. Keep hearing birds. But I think that's on the TVs. <laughs> I can't imagine them having actual birds here. <laughs> yeah, here's automotive too. They even have automotive. And like I was saying, hardware. Ooh, Patriarchs. Oh, and you know what? I need, actually need a flagpole. These ones have the American flag on them, though. I just need a, a flagpole with nothing on it, though. I guess... Guess up. That would be what I would need. Hmm. 
furnace filters. Hopefully we won't need those anymore for a while. <laughs> but anyway, let's take a walk back up this side here and go towards the front of the store where we will be bottled up again by like 733,297,153.4 people. <laughs> Nope, not going that way. Like the Meyer Kohler. Did you guys see that? <laughs> wow, look at all the patriotic stuff they have up here on the left. Wow. Actually got a lot. And then just like that, we're near the front of the store. Here are the registers. I feel like they don't have as many as some of the other locations we've been to, like the one in Stowe. Uh, maybe you want to self-check out? Oh, excuse you. <laughs> you see how they just walk right in front of you? It's like people have no courtesy. That is one time that someone could have said excuse me by doing that. They got a lot of self-checkouts here, which is good. A lot of self-checkouts. They also have they have a nice big flower section too. Lots of flowers, lots of greeting cards. <laughs> lots of greeting cards. And then they have women's clothing up here. So yeah, pretty big store. Now look, I know that it's busy and people are going to be everywhere, but did you literally see as I was walking along the front registers how a guy in a shopping cart just literally went right in front of me? On camera, it might not have been that easy to tell, but he missed me by inches. And that's one time I will get aggravated and say something like, excuse you, because that was uncalled for. You see me walking up, could have either waited or said excuse me as you walked by, but no in a rush to get to the register, but that's okay. I'm in a good mood. This is a great store. It's just, wow, <laughs> some people. <laughs> but I hope you're enjoying the store tour. I'm excited to be here and check this place out. I don't even know where Kayla's at. I can't even find her. <laughs> All right, so aside from the men's clothing, they actually have sports stuff here too for Cleveland and Ohio sports. They have that. The shirt's actually not too bad. I know I'm a Steelers fan, but hey, it's nice to see the Browns do good for once. They even have a shoe department in here as well. They have plenty of shoes. Like I said, it's like a like a smaller Walmart, but in all honesty, much better. Much cleaner, family run, very friendly people, very clean store. I like it. There's not one complaint about Meyer except how I'm almost getting murdered here. <laughs> and here's uh, domestics and decor. Oh, I got mirrors. Oh, there I am. <laughs> but yeah, still, it's a great store. They also have sporting goods. Fishing supplies, camping supplies. Yep, sporting goods though too. As I had mentioned here is their seasonal department in the garden shop, which you saw. Love it. They even have a baby section here on this side once you get past the toys. 
toy department's down that way. Baby section is up this way. Sorry, I'm kind of spinning all around. Then I got all kinds of patriotic stuff. I love the shirts. I love them playing beer pong or beer pong on that. <laughs> That's hilarious. I like the table covers too. Then here is their pharmacy and health and beauty aisles and section. Very, very nice and busy. <laughs> and back to the patriotic stuff. I love the patriotic goodies they have. They have quite the selection. I love the light up flag. Let's see what we got going on over here. Look at all the decor. Wow, we. Very nice. They have quite the selection over here too. I like how you can make popsicles. They even have coolers and bags and towels and cups. More decorations. I like it. And to our friends overseas and in other countries, I'm sorry if I bore you by looking at the patriotic stuff, but that's going to be happening in a few videos this year as we get closer to Memorial Day and Fourth of July and Labor Day, so bear with me, and I hope you enjoy. I hope I'm not boring you too much. <laughs> you know what's nice about this store is they actually take care of your pets here too. Yes, they have a vet veterinarian clinic here. That is amazing, and that's wonderful, and my respect level for Meyer went up 10 times more. You don't see this at Walmart, at least none of the Walmarts I've ever been to. So for them to have a veterinarian here, that's amazing. And thank you very much, Meyer. That, that is wonderful. Look at that, right in the entrance there when you come in. I like the old logo up there, since 1934. Here is their signage on this wall here with it a slogan saying why pay more exactly and show them kayla we're just getting yeah. ready to leave but so there are some associates who are handing out these freebies yeah and i got this cute little meyer bag and inside of it there's uh, flyers about the credit cards and then there's a flyer about the the veterinarian, veterinarian. hey and that's cool on top of it you get a cute little free hand sanitizer bottle <laughs> So that's, that's awesome. Really, that's really cute. That's really nice of them. Yeah. Cool. All right, everyone. Well, that's going to wrap up our store tour here of the brand new Meyer here in Boardman, Ohio. I was so happy for this place to finally open and for us to finally check it out. Kayla and I have had a long, long weekend, and she's very tired, so she's already in the car napping, and here I am doing my outro on the outside. Oh, you're still awake. <laughs> yeah. So... Yeah, because we had Waldemere yesterday. We went to the Pens game before we came out here today. I am ready for a good night's sleep. And I'll be honest, I was really exhausted doing this video for you. Especially with the fact that there was like three times the world's population all shopping in there all at once. But And to the guy that hit me with your shopping cart and didn't even say excuse me. That was, that was an even better one. That was off camera. That wasn't even besides the one that almost hit me with a cart. But the one that actually did. Thank you. Anyway. No complaints with Meyer. This place is great. I'm so glad to have one about an hour away from home as they slowly inch their way further to the east. Who knows? Maybe we'll get lucky and get one in the Pittsburgh area. Meyer, come to Pittsburgh, please. We, we need something that isn't Giant Eagle. Yes, I hate Giant Eagle and Walmart, but Walmart is really all we got because I won't go to Target. And all these hit or miss. Yeah, all these are hit or miss. True. But Meyer, come to Pittsburgh. I would shop there every single time we go to get groceries. Mm-hmm. I would too. So thank you for at least making this store an hour away from home instead of two hours like the one in Stowe. Not that there's anything wrong with the one in Stowe. I like going an hour away instead of two hours away to go on a Meyer run. And then remember you gotta make that hour or two back, so thanks Meyer. Love the new store. Looks great. You guys are awesome. Kayla's giving you guys a thumbs up too. And well, anyway, we're going to take off. I need to get home, and I want to go straight to bed. I am just, I am out of my mind exhausted, and I have to go to work tomorrow. So, 
Yeah, so even though I'm recording this on a Sunday, you probably won't even see this until like Monday or Tuesday, but you know what I'm getting at. So thanks, Meyer. Anyway, take care, everybody. Stay awesome. Oh, have a Meyer delicious day. <laughs> and we'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye, everyone. Yep, they can see your hand. <laughs>